learning, motivation and results. This video provides a description of giving, motivation and results. That is a simplified description of the meaning of giving according to the Dhamma Sata site based on the Engatara Nikaya 7.52, Dana Sutta. As follows. The act of giving which is accompanied by a thought for one's own benefit, with a thought attached to the result, that is, accompanied by the thought that one will enjoy it after death. He gives gifts of food, drink, clothing, vehicles, garlands, perfumes and anointings, bedding, shelter, and lamps, to monks or ascetics. After passing away, he appeared among the four great god kings. Then after the power of his good karma wears off, he is one who will return, return to this world. The act of giving which is not accompanied by a thought for his own benefit, not with a thought attached to the result, that is, which is not accompanied by the thought that he will enjoy it after death. But he gives gifts with the thought, giving is good. He gives gifts of food, drink, clothing, vehicles, garlands, perfumes and anointings, beds, shelters, and lamps, to monks or ascetics. After his death, he appeared among the 33 devas, Tavatimsa Deva. Then after the power of his good karma wears off, he is one who will return, return to this world. The act of giving which is not accompanied by the thought. Giving is good. He gives a gift with the mind. This has been given before, has been done before, by my father and grandfather. It would be wrong if I let this old family tradition come to a halt. After his death, he appeared among the Yama Devas, then after the power of his good karma wears off, he is one who will return, return to this world. The act of giving which is not accompanied by thought. This has been given before, has been done before, by my father and grandfather. It would be wrong if I let this old family tradition come to a halt. He gives gifts with the thought, I am rich. They are not rich. It is wrong that the rich do not give gifts to those who are not rich. After death, he appears among the satisfied devas, to Sita Deva. Then after the power of his good karma wears off, he is one who will return, return to this world. The act of giving which is not accompanied by the thought, I am rich. They are not rich. It is wrong that the rich do not give gifts to those who are not rich. He gave a gift with the thought. Just as the great sacrifices the sages of the past, Ataka, Vamaka, Vamadeva, Vesamitta, Yamadaji, Anjirasa, Bharadvaja, Vasetha, Kasapa, and Bhagu have made, so this gift of mine, after death, appears among the devas who delight in creation, Nimanarati Deva. Then after the power of his good karma wears off, he is one who will return, return to this world. The act of giving without thinking. Just as the great sacrifices the sages have made in the past, Ataka, Vamaka, Vamadeva, Vesamitta, Yamadaji, Anjirasa, Bharadvaja, Vasetha, Kasapa, and Bhagu, so is this gift of mine. He gives gifts with the thought. When this gift of mine is given, it makes the mind calm. Contentment and happiness arise. After death, he appears among the devas who have power over other creations, Paranimita Vasavati Deva. Then after the power of his good karma wears off, he is one who will return, return to this world. The act of giving, not for one's own benefit, 
not with the mind attached to the result, not to collect for oneself, neither with the thought, I will enjoy it after death, neither with the thought, giving is good, neither with the thought, this has been given before, has been done before, by my father and grandfather. It would be wrong if I let this old family tradition come to a halt. But the act of giving with the mind, this is to beautify the mind, to support the mind. After passing away, he appears among the companion Brahmas, Brahma Parasaja Deva. Then after the power of his good karma runs out, he is a non-returner. He didn't come back to this world. Ladies and gentlemen, the conclusion from the long description about the giving of donations is that in the giving of the same funds, the results of the good karma are not the same, depending on the intention of giving. The best karmic fruit for the donor is if the act of giving is meant to beautify and equip his mind to become a better mind, that is, a selfless mind. And of course giving or sowing the best seeds of virtue is if the seeds are sown in fertile soil. About this, ladies and gentlemen have understood it. So this video, hopefully useful. To those of you who watched this video, thank you very much. See you again in another video on the channel. On YouTube. May you be healthy, live a long life. Be happy, have lots of luck, love to do good, and are eager to live life with a peaceful heart.
ಹೊಡಿ